Good morning, everyone. Welcome to the 10th episode of the series. I am the football Ronin. And here we go. Uh, we're off to an early start. Uh, it is Sunday morning, 6.06. .06. I am in Nagoya. Camera's loaded. And I am heading over to Nagoya Station, where I'll be catching the Shinkansen up to Tokyo. Make a brief stop there before proceeding onward to Niigata, which is going to be the location of our 10th stadium, our 10th stop. I will be catching the game between Niigata and Kashiwa Reiso over at the Denwa Big Swan Stadium. The game isn't until 2 p.m. So I think I have plenty of time. Uh, as long as everything goes accordingly, I should get to my I should get to my stop around uh, 10:30 a.m. See me? I got my luggage, and I have uh, another piece of luggage waiting for me at one of the coin lockers at the station. Go. Hey guys, we are about like five minutes away. All right, we just arrived here at Nagoya Station. Let me, I need to go retrieve my luggage from the coin locker, so bear with me. Gross. I thought my train departed at uh, 6.48, it turns out it was 6.43, so I made it just, just with moments to spare. Anyways, to Tokyo, I got this bottled water, obviously, because I am thirsty for 140 yen. You guys just got to Tokyo Station. I just put all my stuff away in a locker. I probably should have shown you guys, but I just need to put them away. Now I'm gonna go look for my Shinkansen that I'm gonna take. Yeah, it's uh 850. My Shinkansen departs at 912, so I have plenty of time. I'm gonna go get a coffee and a snack somewhere. Alright, guys, this is my breakfast for champions. Iced coffee. 350 yen. Donut and sandwich. 608. I am now leaving Tokyo. I just got here. What a morning has been. Like eight more. Anyway, super excited to go to Niigata. We'll see how it turns out. guys just got to Niigata station it is currently 1043 can't really take me what like three four hours to finally get to my destination wicked 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 stuff um pretty cool though I have no idea what I'm gonna do for the next couple of hours probably just walk around most of the attractions are actually out of the city the central part so that's weird but yeah, so I'm gonna figure out what to do. A lot of Kashiwa race. A couple right there. More right there in the back. Wow. Huh. So cool. They made their way all the way from Hitachi. 
But yeah, game's not till 2 p.m. So 11 and 12. I'll probably start heading around 12. Actually, I only have like an hour to spare now I think about it. Yeah. I think I'm just gonna walk to the stadium. I think it takes about 50 minutes to walk. But yeah, it's fine. I don't mind. Alright guys, welcome to Niigata, Irashimase. It's nice and early, mmm that smells good, what is that? Mm, I don't know, I had a small snack, I don't know if I should eat before the game, maybe I'll eat at the stadium, but we'll see. Yeah, so... It's going to be a long run of games coming up for me. Starting, obviously it started yesterday over at Toyota Stadium, which was... Oh, Toyota Stadium caught me off guard. I didn't expect it to be that impressive. And honestly, it was worth the freaking hour long trip to Toyota H, which uh, Toyota's headquarters is. I had no idea. Um, yeah, so it's uh, yesterday's game, today's game. Then I'll be going to uh, Uroa Red Diamonds on Wednesday, followed by a uh, super cool. I'm going to uh, watch uh, FC Tokyo versus um, Kawasaki on Friday, and apparently it's the 30th year anniversary of the J League. And um, instead of hosting it at their home stadium, they're actually going to be playing in the freaking uh, Japan National Stadium. Wicked, right in I think it's in Shinjuku. It's insane. I mean, it's kind of sad because I had planned a whole thing on that day because I, I believe their um, their stadium's located in a Chubo, Chubo, something like that, Chifu, something like that. But there was like a whole bunch of things I was gonna do around there. But it's all good. Super excited. But then yeah, I have that, and then I have another game on Saturday, Sunday, and I think that's it for the rest of the week. And then I'll be flying up to Sapporo on Tuesday. So that's going to be fun. I'll be going up to Sapporo for a couple of days, catching the game there. And then the following morning, I'm going to be flying down to Fukuoka and catch that same day. Oh, man, it's going to be a lot. I don't know if I can do it. I think I have to do it. But I'm going to be flying into Fukuoka on that same day, same afternoon. I'm going to be catching uh, their game. Um, a beast of Fukuoka play and then the following I'll be staying there for a few days as well and um, I'll be catching finally the Sagan Tosu game on midweek that's gonna be a Levian uh, Cup tie though I'm still super excited for this coming next two weeks um, it is my final three weeks here in Japan oh wow what an amazing time I've, ha I've been having here and I just can't believe it's already Three more weeks left and then I go back home. And yeah, just hopefully you guys are enjoying the series. Speaking of the vlogs though, I'm probably not gonna have all of them up as fast as I want them to be up. So hopefully you guys have some patience. I do feel like I should be spreading them up a little bit more too so you guys can take your time with them. I know that some of them are quite long. So maybe this will be good for everyone involved. <laughs> So yeah, but yeah, look at this. Nigata. I wish I had more. Um... Shit, I'm gonna go to the donkey. Um, uh, I wish I had more time to explore the surroundings of Nigata. I hear it's full of nature, but here I am, gonna make the most of it. I'm gonna go in this donkey real quick. I'm gonna get myself a luggage. Good. Just left the donkey. So I just left donkey. Basically, I just went in there to see. I, I need to buy a luggage, piece of luggage. I know I'm gonna be uh, buying a bunch of things so on, on my return to the states. So I was. I just went in there to check it out real fast. I think I might buy it after the game. If not, I'll just buy it in uh, Tokyo. So yeah, I'm like 45 minutes away from the stadium. 
it's 11 31 yeah like i said i'm literally just here for the game unfortunately i wish i could explore more of niigata but you know what it is guys let me tell you though the weather up here is amazing sensational nice and crisp it's probably because it's near the coast and i think there's mountains surrounding it surrounding the city so i think that's pretty nice um it's been so hot further down south where i was and i mean the heat is cool and all but i don't know man i, I it just i can't i can't deal with the heat it's kind of humid too actually now i think about it yeah it is the month of may so i'm assuming the heat and humidity is going to start um towards like mid may the end of uh may so yeah man I, I'm kind of happy to be leaving before that because I, I would suffer in that heat, man. It's funny, though, because, I mean, I live in California, but th that's a different kind of heat. It's, like, more dry. And, I mean, where I'm from, it's not as dry. It's more near the coast, so we get, like, a nice little breeze. Santa Ana winds going through there. Um, what else? Uh, freaking... Oh, yeah, and I used to, I used to live in uh, New York for four years, and... We know how hot and humid uh, New York summers get, so there's that. Uh, I don't know how I survive through there. It's really weird. I do prefer the humidity over the dry. I, I don't know. I don't know why. I think I'm gonna go in this lost room real fast. I was thinking about going somewhere to eat, but um, I don't want to pass my life. I'm only 30 minutes away from the stadium, but still. Let's see. I'm sure there's like a little shopping district street. Alright guys, midday snack and some water. All for 354 yen. These are amazing. The chicken here from Lawson are stupendous. Alright, I'm gonna eat this real fast. Hey guys, so my first impression of Niigata is honestly pretty quiet, peaceful. Oh, look at this. That seems very laid back compared to other prefectures or cities I've been to so far. Yeah, it's very interesting. I like it. I personally like it. It's giving me a little, you know, time to breathe and just don't feel too pressed. I'm enjoying it so far. As I had mentioned guys, a lot of walking today. Just found this pretty crazy staircase. Wonder where it leads. All right, finally seeing some people. Surely they're heading to the stadium. And the rain is starting to pick up, y'all. Amazing.
that's the stadium over there. Oh my gosh. Another beautiful stadium awaits us. I believe this one's a slightly bigger than the Toyota Stadium from yesterday. This one holds a capacity of approximately 45,000 compared to the one yesterday. Yesterday's, I believe, was uh, 42,000. Very similar in accommodating. Oh, look at this pretty little piano. Oh, that's pretty. All right, guys. <laughs> look at this beast of a stadium. Let me get a bit closer, get a better shot, and I will present it to you, as always. Wow. Oh my gosh. This place is brilliant. Insane, guys. Wow. Look at that. Woo oh man. What a great, beautiful stadium. Man. Just like yesterday's. I am quite impressed. Wow. This place is only an hour and a half away from Tokyo uh, by Shinkansen. Um, obviously the stadium itself, if you walk, it's another hour, but you can always take the bus, which is only a 20 minute ride. I might go ahead and do that on the way back. But yeah, look at this. I knew I should have just bought something here. Preview. Probably gonna cross this little bridge platform. Okay. Oh, five hundred for beer. Ventura, Ventura. So cool. Not sure what the crowds here are gathering for, but a little crowd going. You know, uh, something Niigata is uh, very uh, renowned for is uh, their sake. Um, I might have some on the way um, back to Tokyo. I know they have some at the train station. They have a couple of breweries here as well. I just don't have enough time. Oh, I didn't have enough time. But yeah. Decided to go inside. Look at this place. Marvelous, marvelous venue. Smells so good. Welcome to the tenth stop here of the J1 League Tour, Denka Big Swan Stadium, home to uh, Albirex Niigata. Today's venue, where they will be hosting Kashiwa Raceo. Humongous, beautiful stadium, holds a capacity of 45,000 people. Pretty cool so far. I just copped this bag for 530 yen. I've been looking for Hajime no Ippo everywhere. Let's go. It was almost. Let me get my ticket out actually. E gate. Alright guys, I'm gonna start heading in. I don't believe they have a magnet. I mean a magnet, a pin. They only have magnets. Cool, oh, I'm in guys. Okay. Alright, so they definitely don't speak as much English around here. I had a little bit of trouble asking for things. I was trying to look for a pen. I didn't see any, but uh, yeah, it was a whole interesting process. Yeah, um, other than that, so far so good. Walk up the stairs. Ah oh, man, I can't believe I found out of all the places I've been to in Japan, I can't believe I found 
Hajime no Ipo merch here in Yota. Oh, right outside the city. Really, <laughs> I love that. Alright, I don't know where I'm going. It's somewhere in here. Yeah, I think it's just through this. I already, they already checked my gate. I mean, my gate, my ticket. They checked my ticket. So, I think it's just finding my seat. Grabbing myself a beer. Your good old fashioned routine. Let's do it. Still going. What is the exit? I am. This is E2? I don't know. I'll figure it out. Alright, uh, I'm gonna go get a drink. Alright, guys, I got myself a Biru Sapporo for 800 yen. It's kind of expensive, but pretty cool. Cheers. Let's go find my seat. Looks like I have to go upstairs, y'all. I'm honestly not sure. But I'm going this right way. Well, here we go. Let's go check it out.
ça. Game ends in an nil nil. Alright guys, game ends in a nil nil. Pretty entertaining bout for the most part. Uh, first half, um, Niigata dominated the, the game. Um, they had plenty of opportunities. Uh, one goal ruled offside. Second half, uh, I think they started uh, wearing them out. Um, Kashiwa actually managed to uh, rattle the goalkeeper on several number of occasions. But um, other than that, I think, yeah, I think there was a lot to be uh, played for at the end. Nonetheless, I had an amazing time. The stadium is a beautiful stadium. Yo, guys, I found the pin. I was heading on out and I found this it's for 750 yen. Not too bad. Anyways, I am gonna start heading on out. It is pouring. Wish me luck. Uh, it's gonna take me about an hour to walk over to the train station. But uh, yeah, I had a fun time here in Niigata. The uh, stadium was a magnificent one. And yeah, I'm ready for the next stop. Yeah, so the next stop on the tour is going to be um, over back in uh, near Tokyo. I'm gonna be watching Odawa Red Diamonds uh, go up against Sagantosus. That's gonna be over on Wednesday. So looking forward to that one as well. I am going back to Tokyo. I'm gonna be there for one whole week. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the latest vlog. Um, it was a rainy one. I know it might be short. It wasn't much to, uh, oh, I didn't have enough time to explore Niigata to its full extent. But nonetheless, I hope you guys enjoyed today's adventure. And I'll see you next time. Uh, football Ronin, out. Thank you.